Oh, welcome to my place. This is where we're going to be doing our crafts and flowers from now on. And today I've got a wonderful thing I want to share with you and it's called foil art. Fantastic product that is pliable and bendable. You can use it on fabric, you could use it on plates, on glass, on tiles. Today I'm going to demonstrate using it on a tile. Now there's only two products that you need. It's the foil glue and then over here I've got the foil paper. Now this comes in many, many colors. I'm using the, the uh, silver because that's going to enhance what I want to do today. Okay, to begin, make sure that your tile is completely clean and free of any kind of dirt or dust or grease. And if you're still unsure, just get a bit of isopropyl alcohol and run that over the whole thing and let that alcohol dry off. Right, from there, the next thing is to get your glue and it comes with a wee nozzle. Now you have to make sure that that nozzle is nice and clean. You need to next put a design down onto your tile or your, your um, surface or whatever you're going to use on. And then gently, gently just squeeze this out. So I'm going to do a rose just freehand here. If you've never done a rose before, it's just really a little wee series of twisty little wee curly swirls like so. Keep going until you get this to the size of which you want to do that. Okay, and then we might just have a wee stem coming down there. And let's just do a leaf over there. Now that needs to dry flat for a good 24 hours or until such times as it's nice and tacky. Right, put that to one side and I've got one here that I did yesterday and you'll see that as it dries it becomes quite transparent. Hopefully this bit here is completely dry but I know that that is and when you touch it just put your hand on it and it should feel nice and tacky. Right from there the next thing to do is to get your foil paper and from there that what you do is you put it shiny side down and then you just basically just run your finger all over that surface keep rubbing it until such times as that silver starts to come off now you might need to give it quite a hard rub but I'm not sure whether this is completely dry so I'm going to have to be a little bit careful the way that I approach this right just keep rubbing and you'll see that it's starting to come off I really should get in here and give it a little bit of a harder rub but you'll see how it's starting to all come off so you could see on the paper now I need to go in there and do it just a little bit more in fact I will I'll just rub that around there foil art was re I'm sorry about my sniffing nose but I have got quite a bit of a cold it is the start of the winter and I would rather have my cold now but in the 80s this was really popular and they used to rub over coins and things like that but just keep rubbing until that all starts to come over pull it away and if it still needs a wee bit more just place it down and keep going as easy as that and in a moment I'll show you other things that I've done with this little fabulous on a wall how easy was that all materials can be purchased from spotlight call again and here you go fantastic embellishing on a wall better than wallpaper